what's up everybody it is day five of the reading rush and it is uh just after like 1 30 and it's been a busy day because i woke up and immediately went out on errands with my mom for picking up wedding things and now i have to get my fiance from work and if i leave now then i can have like five minutes of reading time waiting for him but i cannot count on that um and then after that i have my first bridal shower and i'm super excited but it's like a really busy day so we'll see how much reading i can get done <laughs> this is just kind of the introduction for the day saying i don't know how much reading i'll get done but i really want to read um the secret garden but the thing is is so i just got notifications from my library and I don't know if I'm going to be able to get The Princess Bride in time because I tried to get it as an ebook, but there was a really long wait and I still am waiting for it and I called the library this morning and they might have it for me tomorrow because they're not actually open today, so we'll see. I'm, I'm hoping that I can, but otherwise if, if I can't get it tomorrow, then I have tomorrow and then the day after to read another book where I've seen the movie but I haven't read the book and I don't have very many of those on my shelves if I have any or at least not ones that I've read before like I've, I saw Peter Pan before I read the book but I read the book earlier this year things like that like I saw the movie Le Petit Prince before I read The Little Prince but again I read the book earlier this year so I don't I don't know because I don't want to reread them but like they're such quick reads that I could just to get the challenge done but we'll see I'll worry about that tomorrow but for today I'm just gonna focus on the secret garden whenever I have a minute to quick and do that since I've been out and about so much today I just got home and I'm just about to leave again so it's been easy to fulfill it in the read it outside of your house but yeah so that's my update for now I'll catch up with you guys later to see if I actually read anything today <laughs> Busy days, busy days. It's day six. It is Saturday and I am outside ready to read for The Secret Garden, hopefully. Um, I should hear back, if I don't hear back from the library today about getting The Princess Bride, then I'm gonna have to choose something else to do and so I will film that later. Although, my sister is coming for the bridal shower today and she'll be here until tomorrow, the last day of the reading rush, so I don't no. Everything's just so up in the air right now, and it's my mom's birthday, so we're also celebrating that after the shower, so plenty of things are happening, and so I'm hoping I can get reading done, I, but I just don't know if I'm going to complete all the challenges, because I value sleep. I do. So, yep, here I go. I'm going. <laughs> almost one in the morning of day six like the end of day six the beginning of day seven for the reading rush and I just got done going through all of the gifts from the bridal shower that I had today and just kind of putting those together with the bridal shower the gifts from the bridal shower of yesterday and just kind of seeing Okay, so what all do we have? Were there any repeats and um, things like that? Kind of getting it organized, but then also with how um, Brennan and I are going to move to Minnesota. Because we have a Prius, um, we're not going to be able to move everything in one trip. So we're also organizing it into what do we need for the apartment immediately versus what can wait until my parents come up the next weekend over Labor Day weekend to bring us the rest of the stuff. So that has been, that has taken up quite a bit of time, and my sister is in town as well, so of course I have to spend time with her, and I need to play games with her and everything like that. Um, but before the bridal shower, I did actually manage to sit outside in the front lawn, as you all saw, and actually read, like, I literally read like the first third of The Secret Garden, and I think it's getting better. It moves kind of slowly. 
but it's also like a fast read because you know the language is a lot easier to understand it's a big print so like I can read it quickly but I feel like the story and the plot moves kind of slowly um but I'm also kind of okay with that I just I just need to get it done so I did not get word from the library about if my book was in if the princess bride was in so I'm gonna assume I'm not gonna get it on time because the libraries are not open on Sundays so I was going to look through my shelf and try and choose a new book but so many books I just like recently read and so I don't want to reread them but as I literally turned my head right before filming this I saw that on the top of my shelf I own The Help and I realized I have seen the movie The Help so I could do that and I could switch up my TBR and read The Help instead as that would still um, complete the prompt of watching the movie before you read the book because that's literally the only prompt that I do not have covered by either The Gilded Wolves which I have completed or The Secret Garden so but the thing is tomorrow is the last day and I am playing a 10 hour board game with my brother and my fiance and some my cousin and a friend of ours so we shall see I did not plan that very well we actually did not plan it very well um, because my sister is in town and so we wanted to spend more time with her but Oops, <laughs> everyone's been super tired and busy, so I mean, but yeah. So one of the prompts that I was doing for The Secret Garden was reading it outside of the house, and I've done that all the way up until this point, however, um, at this point I just kind of want to get it done as soon as possible so that I can try and read The Help, because The Help is not exactly a small book, like it's not huge. But it's not exactly small either, so <laughs> um, I don't know if I'll be able to complete it in the reading rush, which would be such a bummer. But if I'm going to do that, I need to read now, and I don't want to start the help because I for sure want to finish The Secret Garden first because it is a classic and July is supposed to be my month of catching up on classics, um, but also it fulfills more prompts. <laughs> So, they, because of the pandemic and because of COVID-19, uh, the Reading Rush has kind of allowed us to stretch the rules quite a bit in that you, they've said, you know, if you can't go out of your house for whatever reason, then do something special for reading the book. And so I'm thinking of sitting here in my bed and reading The Secret Garden because I'm not going outside right now. Uh, no, because skunks live around here. We've been trying to catch a groundhog, but we're super scared of catching the neighborhood skunk, so I'm not reading outside. But I do have a window right here next to my bed. That's where I hang my lights. Um, so I am debating on opening up the window and reading it by the window as that's as close as to outside I can get right now. And I may even play some like nature outdoors ASMR or kind of nature sounds to kind of go along with it and put me in the uh, vibe of being outside. So I might just do that and try and read a little bit more at the Secret Garden before I go to bed tonight. I don't want to stay up too late because I'm going to be playing such a long board game for all of tomorrow and it's a huge strategy game and that is not my forte. Um, so I do need sleep but also I really want to read. So yeah, that's the update for now. I would like day 7 to be its own thing because I'm hoping to also do a wrap up in that vlog even if it's the next day. But. For the most part, I've been pretty proud of my vlogs because A, they haven't been super long because my computer hates really long videos, um, and B, I've done something in each vlog. I didn't do a day three vlog at all because I didn't do anything book related on day three. It was just a complete wedding day for me, but other than that, I have been doing really well with vlogging and so I'm just a little proud of myself. Because I've noticed that I get really repetitive in my videos. Like, I'll say something 
at the beginning of the book, and then when I review it at the end, I say it like three or four times. So I'm trying to be better about that, so. Yeah, so I'm going to say this is the end of day six, <laughs> because I'm going to do a little bit of reading, and I will go to bed, and so that's going to be the end of this vlog. And so everything else will be in the next video, so stay tuned for that. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, continue following me on this journey of the reading rush, but also different genres every month, and then next year I will have a little bit more of a normal reading type year where I will mostly read genres that I like. But yeah, so with that, I'm going to wish you guys a happy reading.